What's going on good people? In today's video here for Sekiro Shadows Die Twice, I'm going to give you guys a few tips on how to locate Robert's firecrackers. So with them on, let's get started. So the first place where we can acquire the firecrackers from is the outskirts wall on the Gaith Path. So you can travel off to this location, man. It's available pretty early on. Uh, make your way off in this direction. I took out all the enemies, or most of the enemies, just to make things easier for us. What you want to do, man, is grapple up over here. And you see that tent right over there in the distance? That is where the merchant is located at. So let's make our way over there, man. Jump on down. And we just need to get up to this uh, left wall or mountain or hill or whatever the hell it is. <laughs> over here. So the first place we could do is grapple up over here. And let's do our little ninja jump up here. And then ninja jump up there. And then when you get to this point, just look up. Grapple up here. And there is the merchant man. So go ahead, speak to him. Snatch up Robert's firecrackers after you talk to him. And then you should be good to go. Um, the second place where you can actually acquire these firecrackers from is if you go to the castle gate. And this is where you fight the uh, first real boss, I guess, the dude on the horse. So... Um, after you take him out, man, make your way off in this direction. I'm gonna speed things up just a little bit. So we're not here all day. Bank this right. You can go ahead and talk to that dude over there to the left. Come up these stairs. And here is the second merchant that you can acquire the uh, firecrackers from. At least those are the two that I found. I'm not too sure if there are more. Maybe somebody can let me know in the comments below. But once you uh, have acquired Robert's firecrackers, uh, go back and speak to old boss man. And then um, just go ahead and talk to him, man, and ask him to uh, add those firecrackers onto your uh, prosthetic arm. And then you should be good to go. Uh, so, folks, that is pretty much that, man. I just wanted to give you guys a few tips on how to locate the firecrackers in Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Let me know what you guys' thoughts on the comments below. As always, I appreciate the support. And with that there, fellas, man, I guess I will see you guys in the next video.